All right, I really don't know why War of Will is not the favorite in this race. He should be the betting favorite, in my opinion. He's uh, the Preakness winner, ninth in the Belmont. Um, I guess because Tacitus ran second in the Belmont, they think that that makes him uh, better somehow. Um, I guess Tacitus did beat him in the um, Kentucky Derby, uh, despite the trouble he had in that race. So maybe that's the reason why. He's third favorite, though. I think uh, War Will's strong horse. I think he's got a really good chance of winning this. He's not a real front runner, but he's the only uh, real stalker that's in this race, so he's probably going to get the lead, probably not going to face too much pressure. Um, it's not going to be sloppy, but even so, if he can control the pace and uh, just get enough position, burn enough distance between these other horses, he can leave them behind. I mean, if he goes out fast enough, he could go and take off and really leave these horses behind and run away with this one and look great. That would raise his uh, stock for Horse of the Year uh, uh, tremendously if he could get a great, great win in this one and then go uh, into the Travers. So he's back. Uh, Tyler Gafalion is riding him again. Um, no change there. Mark Casey, the trainer. Um, he's out of Warfront, as we know, um, who's from uh, Danzig, uh, Sadler's Wells horse. I mean, I think that's the reason why he didn't fare so well at a mile and a half. He's not really bred for that mile and a half distance. Oh, not really for the mile and a quarter. However, at this mile and an eighth distance, um, you know, with the mile and one si or three sixteenths of the Preakness, he, he did pretty well. You know, he may have even done better in the Derby had he not run into trouble in that race. So, War of Will, I expect to be a definite contender. Um, pretty sure he's going to hit the board. I mean, there's only six horses in this race. Uh, I, I, I like him a lot. Not necessarily picking him as the winner. Got to finish handicapping it. But uh, War of Will is definitely a strong one in this one. His uh, workout times, if uh, he's decent in 13th of July, he had a one-minute breathing five furlong, slacked off a little bit on the 19th, but hey, you know, those only mean so much. I mean, maximum security works out terribly, you know, they just don't work him out fast. So that doesn't really mean everything, but he's, he's got a decent workout, um, so it looks to be in decent shape, and I think um, War of Will uh, will be calling his name near the end. Uh, don't know if it will be as a winner or running second, but I really think he's going to be in it.